hello everybody again good old mr tim here and i decided to keep my promise and make a part two of the chrono cross dream team voice cast which i highly doubt this game will ever get a remake but why not just pick some voices for these characters just because i have a more likely chance of chrono trigger getting a remake so yeah anyway let's go ahead and start picking out some voices or see my choices let's go first off is viper the old man very powerful old man too and he's an interesting character in some regards uh the problem with chrono cross is a lot of characters are losing uh character development and they're not exactly intriguing anyhow i do have one certain voice picked out just for him and that voice goes to steve kramer the voice of the third Hokage, and also the voice of... I can't remember his name from Bleach, because I don't watch a lot of Bleach. But yeah, I'm a big fan of Steve Kramer's work, and I think his voice would fit this character really, really well. I was going to originally go with David Lodge, but I had David as one of the three gurus of time. Anyhow, let's roll the clips and move on. Mura. They just won the first battle at Toba Fushimi. The true revolution is just around the corner, and yet you've decided to quit. And you don't even have a sword! Alright, next is my third favorite character out of Chrono Cross, Lena. And honestly, I have only one good voice choice for her, and it was actually the voice that I really picked out the first time. And that goes to Sarah Williams. I think Sarah, if she does her performance of Sayaka Miki from... Madoka Magica, I think she would be able to nail this character's personality perfectly. It's just a little silly personal opinion, but hey, I think she's got a great voice, and she can sing well too. No, it's not me. I'm just a little old raspberry. That big brown cake's too red, don't you know? Could the cake be killed? Yet we have another personal favorite of mine, Karsh. And I really do like this character a lot. I think he's funny, and I do like the fact that he is driven mainly by his whole duty thing that he will do whatever it takes. But the voice I have found for this character is Skip Stelret. Yes, I know, I keep casting Skip in a lot of things, but hey, I could see him doing his vicious voice and pulling off this character's personality perfectly to a T. I know it sounds insane, but let's roll the clips and see what you think. A oh, ravenous beast. The same blood runs through both of us. The blood of a beast who wanders, hunting for the blood of others. Next is Riddell, and I really don't know if I'm saying that right, or Rydell, Riddell, I have no idea. She's a more elegant character, very soft-spoken, and she can get loud if she needs to be. She's actually pretty strong, too. The voice choice I have for her is going to be kind of unusual, but I'm going to go with it anyway. And that choice is Kate Higgins. I think Kate would be able to pull off this character. She has played some elegant characters in the past before, like Saber. She originally voiced her in the 2006 adaptation of Fate Stay Night. So I think she would be able to handle this character with no problems whatsoever. You got that right. Denigrating women is a relic of the feudal age. Down with discrimination! Next is Riedel's fiance, I guess, or engaged. I, I have no idea. Dario or Dario or whatever. Is it Mario? No, I'm just kidding. And there is one good voice choice I have for him. Honestly, I took one look at the character and I just automatically picked this guy. And that choice goes to Steve Blum. Yes, or Bloom. I don't know. Anyhow, I think Steve would be able to capture his more eviler side. I know he is a optional boss, but I still think Steve's voice would contribute a lot if they put him in the remake of the game. Anyhow, let's move on. My eyes, Faye. One of them is a fake because I lost it in an accident. Since then... I've been seeing the past in one eye, and the present in the other. Next is Marcy, the cute little creepy little girl thing. And yeah, this, this character kind of gives me the creeps, because she comes off human, and yet she could be like a psychotic killing machine if she needs to be. 
Anyway, I have one perfect little voice picked out, and she's got to sound cutesy, so that voice goes to Stephanie Shea. And guess what? I have never casted Stephanie Shea in any of my Dream Team videos. So this works out. Finally, I could cast her in something. Yay! I think Stephanie would be able to capture the voice of this, you know, character perfectly. Her personality would rub off. She's able to capture the creepy side, the cutesy side, and turn it all on a dime with her voice. Berserker can't lose to anyone because he's the strongest in the world! Onto the big, hunking, metal man himself, Zoa. Well, at least his helmet's made of metal. I actually am in the middle of this game right after he's introduced, and I'm reading his text and everything, and there's only really one voice that, to me, that could fit this character. And he has played a Masked Knight before in the past, and that voice choice is gonna go to... Kyle Hebert. Yep, yeah, a lot of you guys were probably thinking I was gonna say Chris Sabat. Stupid-ass question is that. I'm rich and I'm dead sexy! <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> Dear God. A anyway, um, I think Kyle's voice is much more fitting because he did play Berserker in Fate Zero and he did a really damn good job. I think he would have a better voice than Sabat would. Praise the praise, huh? Look at that now, huh? <laughs> I'm dead sexy. Okay, I'm sorry. It's, it's the last one, I promise, for now. For now. Anyway, I think Kyle would be great. Let's listen to a clip of his Gohan, and then this will be the last character I'm going to do for the day. If it wasn't for the help of Supreme Kai, but that's all in the past. Oh yeah? Well, I understand your feelings are hurt, but I don't think you have much of a choice. Anyway, that about does it for my Chrono Cross Dream Team voice cast part two. Stay tuned for part three. I should have it out shortly or whenever. It's just whenever I get around to playing it. Let me know in the comments what you think, and always remember, I'm listening.